unedited vlog again because I have so many groceries to put up. Like, look at that. And then I'm in the process of actually making some dinner. These are just some made tacos. They're beef and cheese. I've, I've never had these before. They only take 7 to 10 minutes to make. So we're going to put groceries in and cook in this vlog. So basically, it looks really cute right here. But anyway, I'm just going to do it. Basically, I've been spending a lot of money I probably shouldn't have. But that's okay. Um, also, guys, look. There we go. We got a new little thingy over here. The other one just took up way too much space. Just way too much. I don't even know where to put anything. So it's going to throw in the deep freeze. I don't know what exactly. No, I better not do that because last time I heard was so good. shopping the other girls at work. Bought lunch meat, just set the whole bag in the fridge instead of putting it in the door where it belongs. Like that just aggravates me so bad. Like how long does it help in the drawer and put it in the door? Like seriously. Maybe I just complain too much. But anyway, I'm just really tired right now. Um, don't really know where to put anything. All this stuff has probably sat out way too long. two days go 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 and especially today for some reason it just my whole body aches so I don't know what that's all about six times by now. Okay, the rest of it's just going to have to go back in the other freezer. The oven has to be at 475 and it's only at 270.
just organize this some other day because I just can't right now with it. More parchment paper. Oh well. Depending on how bad it is after work, I'll probably I'll pick up some. By the time this vlog goes up, I will let you guys know how good these are because I've never had them before. in there which isn't bad because they were like four dollars or something um, anyway but we got a project that's going to be happening tomorrow actually i don't know if my husband's going to be filming it or not because well i'm not going to be home i'll be at work Sorry for the washer, uh, but um, he's going to be working on our closet, the guest room closet, to put more shelving in there so we have more um, what's the word? storage, there you go, and we, when we went to Lowe's also to get that stuff for the closet tomorrow, we are looking around and we have an idea because we got to redo our bathroom. Basically, we gotta redo the flooring in the bathroom. Um, I forgot exactly how he worded it, but since, he's like, "Well, since I'm doing that, we might as well just upgrade everything in there, like the toilet, the sink, the shower." So we have all this stuff picked out, y'all. We're gonna be doing marble in the bathroom. I'm excited. But anyway, we got the bathroom all planned out. We got the because we're also gonna be redoing the flooring in here. Um, and then we're going to eventually do the kitchen again. Um, I know kids, oh, you just did your kitchen, blah, 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 blah. We want to read, like, we got to do the countertops for sure. Because we, 
we really don't like how it is and plus the sink we don't like it and we only have two drawers and there's like 15 billion outlets in here so we're just going to redo the kitchen um I know they're going to probably really love the cabinets we picked out because I'm excited I don't want to give away any hints um and we also got the floor picked up for the kitchen the bathroom the living room and our bedroom we're going to do carpet in there and then my office too. Not doing carpet, but anyway. Doing the flooring in there too. And we're gonna work on the deck. So yeah. The first thing is going to be the closet in the guest room right now. And I think the next project after that will be the deck, I wanna say maybe. I don't know. If you wanna know why we do the deck, or we are going to redo the deck is because um, the one railing, it's been bad since we first got it. It leans really bad and I'm just afraid if we have guests over and someone leans up against it and they fall, they're going to get hurt and I don't want that on me, you know. And some of the boards are trying to give out and the very bottom step is really bad now like I told him I was like I'm afraid to even to have anything delivered here at the house even though here lately they've been going to the back port not the back porch the back door but um, I'm afraid someone's gonna step on that and get hurt somehow and I was like I don't want really to get sued for that because I had a bath bed doing a garage outside so there's some new exciting things coming eventually um, we've had this house since August of 2019 and it's now 2021 so it'll be like two years this year in August since we've had this house so yeah we're like we want to eventually you know if we have kids upgrade to a better house and if we do like all these renovations and stuff I guess you can say and when we do go to sell it the price will hopefully go up because we did so much renovation the people when we bought this house were doctors and they basically just kind of like fix this house up really quick and then put it on the market you can tell they did it really quickly because there's some things in the house that are just like, why would you do that? Like, there's just some things I question. But, anyway. So I'm waiting on my husband to text back if it's okay to put the food in. Because I don't know how far he is at the car wash. I also need to make some tea. So I guess we can do that while we wait. I'm going to make this video a little bit longer. Just for five of these tacos, if anybody is interested, it's 230 calories. And I so said there's 25, so we'll be splitting. So it'll be 12 each. So, 12 and a half. Hold on a second, guys. I gotta get the. Uh, I like to actually boil the tea, but there's just some days I really love our Mr. Coffee tea and coffee maker thing over here. 
I know it's not in frame, but it needs to be cleaned really bad. But basically, if you guys ever buy one of these, you take your thing, the little pitcher that comes with it, and fill it up with water to the water line. So we will do that. Fill it up with water. I got dishes that need to come away so we can wear this. the water line. I'm trying to trip up for the cord. Okay. And then this area back here there's like some lines. It's kind of, it looks like a grate. Ammo. Right here on the side you can't probably see this. But anyway you just pour the water in back there. Basically, you put your tea bags in here, and you put this whole contraption into the pitcher, and then where the end of it right here is, you will like push it to here, and then turn the button on, and it'll be going. So. I use two because they're like the smaller ones. Okay. Oh, and anyway, there's two little bags. They're just the Lipton iced tea southern sweet. And you want to really put it like right in the middle where the um, hole is. That way you get more um, of the flavor and not just water. So then you just push it up. It doesn't latch, which I don't really like, but you just push the button on the side and it should be starting. I boil it on the stove like while it's boiling I will take my tea pitcher fill it up with water like this much water and then put the sugar in and then pour it all in but anyway my battery is dying so I hope you guys enjoyed this little cook with me just kidding but anyway I'll see you guys in my next vlog um, make sure you follow my Instagram, subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.